Hi Aquarius, thank you for joining. And this is going to be your weekly love reading. Okay, there's a situation involving children here. Somebody you here is either pregnant or just had a baby or just found out someone is pregnant with child. Okay, so you could, and this does not have to be, you don't have to be the one that's pregnant, but the energy is popping up. Okay, somehow, some way, there are children involved, but for some of you guys, and somebody here is trying to, I feel like th there's energy surrounding a connection that someone is lying about a pregnancy, okay, or someone is looking for the truth when it comes to there's no trust in someone's connection. I'm just going to say say that. I don't know. There's a serious, there's two cars out here talking about trust. I don't, um, and, and there's someone here in the situation saying they love me, like they know their self, self-worth, but somebody here does not know their self-worth. Somebody here is in a situation where they feel like they're not being valued and, um, this could be a twin. Okay. Toxic relationship underneath that or toxic patterns. Okay, two cards of trust issues. Somebody's about to find out some information. Maybe someone here is finding out something through the great, like going through somebody's phone. They're finding out through the great line. There's a woman in this car asking a masculine about some information that she sees over the phone. Yeah, moving on. Somebody, I'm telling you, is getting ready to leave. Now, it, it, it can be a female, like a male could be asking a female. I mean, yeah, a male could be asking a female, like, you know, it could be vice versa. Yeah, there's definitely some third party energy here. And somebody's just jetting away. Somebody's leaving. Somebody's literally jetting away from a city. Yeah, there's distance. I'm telling you, somebody's getting ready to create distance or they already created the distance. Like somebody is physically leaving, going somewhere. I mean, there's somebody here that may have very well tried to <laughs> purposely lie and sabotage something here. This is karm very karmic -y energy. Show me more. A lot of karmic energy here. All right. Show me more here. The Ace of Wands. Somebody is about to either have a baby or this involved a sexual matter. Okay. The Strength card in reverse. Definitely Leo energy here. Jeez. Oof. Mm -mm -mm. I feel like. Somebody here, ooh, three of cups and reverse, honey, 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 listen, I'm telling you, there is a scandal, I don't know, <laughs> there's a scandal about a baby, I'm telling you, ten of cups in reverse, there is an unhappy home, honey, there is an imbalance, there's disharmony, there's discord, there is conflict, there may even be fighting, I, you know, there's definitely a separation getting ready to happen. Mm-hmm. The world card, three of pentacles in reverse, and the world is in reverse. This is not not good for whoever's in this situation, you guys, this is not good. All right, fixed sign energy with the world. Leo, Taurus, okay, Aquarius, uh, Scorpio. But like the Three of Pentacles in reverse, man, whoever this is, I'm telling you, there's disharmony, there's discord with this Three of Pentacles in reverse. Uh, too much ego, too much pride, especially with the strength in reverse here. It, it, it's, it's, it's bad. It's a bad situation. There's a lot of conflict. There's just a lot of conflict. I... Somebody here is real hurt and, and they they feel awful. They, they, there is a scandal, okay? There is a scandal. The hangman in reverse. Ooh, child. Somebody is trying to avoid an ending. Somebody is stalling, trying to avoid an ending, or you got someone, whoever lied about a child or a situation, they could have tried to avoid this information coming out, or, or if they didn't try to avoid the situation coming out, they're stalling 
somebody's trying to stall this other person from leaving whoever lied that could be the case too the person who may have lied about the child or whoever this is um they're trying to prolong this person from possibly leaving Somebody definitely try, is trying to avoid this for as long as they possibly could. The judgment card, but now they cannot. Scorpio energy and Pisces energy here with the hangman and reverse and judgment card upright. Somebody, it's somebody's day of reckoning. I don't know what else to say here. Queen of Cups in reverse. Good grief. I. Somebody was emotionally manipulative. There's a Queen of Cups here, emotionally manipulative here. That pro that's probably the person who, ooh, show me more. Who lied. Knight of Cups in reverse, who manipulated the situation. I have never seen so much karmic drama in, this is, this Queen of Cups in reverse is somebody who has tantrums. They throw a fit. They want to throw shit or when they get mad, um, you know, when they don't, they lie to get their way. Well, they throw a fit when they don't get their way with, you know what I'm saying, whoever this is feminine is. And then if, if that, that causing the drama doesn't work, then this person will lie. I feel like this is somebody who will lie, cheat, steal, do anything. Just turmoil, straight up and down. This is the person. I don't know. I don't know. This person tried to avoid conflict for as long as they could, but they were not able to escape it. Three of swords in reverse. The fool in reverse. You see what I'm saying? Aries energy and Libra energy here. Did somebody is heartbroken as hell and mad and pissed. I don't know. It's because of their reckless behavior. You know, somebody was careless, reckless, foolish, dumb. Dumb and dumber. I don't know. Ooh, ooh. Mm. Clarify the fool in reverse. The cherry in reverse. Somebody is not growing, maturing like they're supposed to. And the two of wands. Somebody planned this, I feel like. Somebody planned this. This is, Here's the thing. Somebody took a risk. They knew they took a risk when they did this. They knew this was going to be risky, whatever they was doing. They knew there was a chance that they were going to... This person feels powerless at this point. They did this to try to maintain power, I believe, and, and, and they planned this out. This was calculated, and now they're pissed and aggressive because they feel a lack of control. Straight card in reverse. They tried to force somebody to stay somewhere and be somewhere. They tried to pull on this. Other person possibly leaving. Two of Swords just came out for some reason. I didn't even ask the question, but... The Knight of Wands in reverse? Good grief. I'm telling you, whoever this person is, they lack self-control. They were definitely reckless. And now somebody here is stuck with making a choice and they have a very difficult choice. I feel like that choice is, do I stay or do I go? With the two of swords and nine of wands and reversing the lover's card, Gemini energy. You know what I'm saying? Now somebody's like, do I stay or do I go? What do I do? Do I try to make this work? Temperance in reverse. I don't feel like I can really heal this. There's too much disharmony. There's too much discord. It's, it's just too much recklessness and I, it's just a no. Someone here was very, very reckless. And the thing is, I feel like even though there's a reckless feminine here, th there's also, a, to me, I get a recklessness from a masculine too. I do. I get a recklessness from a masculine too. But I don't, I don't know if it's uh, as bad as this feminine, but let's see. Can you show us the masculine's energy, please? This person cannot rest. They're sick. But I'm going to tell you this. 
Um, I feel like they're the one releasing and awakening and getting ready to move on. Show me this masculine energy, please. Let me show full. Show me this masculine energy with this four swords in reverse. Oof. Wait, what was that? The hero fine in reverse. Whoa. Somebody may not want to be tied down anymore. Hold on. The sun card. Somebody. Leo energy, Taurus energy. Hold on. Let me look at this and see. <sighs> I feel like someone ne ne neglected their inner child. There's a bunch of messages here. First, I feel like someone neglected their inner child. They tried to prolong an awakening for as long as they could right they know they had a lot of things to heal from their childhood wounds their past and this person is still stuck in that childhood energy which is why they're making awful decisions we talk about the masculine still and i feel like also too there's an energy here of this person wanting to escape from a situation that involves a child so for some of y'all, this person doesn't want to be committed to the person that they have the child with. The child may not be theirs with this page of cups being in reverse and the sun card being upright. Um, clarify the page of cups in reverse. Ten of wands. Crossing. That's the burden. Wow. This person is so unhappy and disappointed. There is just so much awful energy, I feel like. So, can you show me here who's leaving? Who's leaving this situation? Show me the energy of the person leaving. Whoever's leaving... They are leaving a, a, either a marriage or a home, okay? Because the Four of Wands is here in reverse. They could be an Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius. The Four of Wands is here in reverse, and the Hierophant is here in reverse. Whatever situation this is, whether it's children or family or what, Ten of Cups is here in reverse. The Ten of Wands came out crossing. It's just... This is over. This is really over Three of Wands, there's no growth. There's no stability. There, it's, it's just, it's not going to go anywhere. Somebody's frustrated, extremely frustrated. There are too many obstacles. There's a ton of flipping obstacles. Every time you turn around, there's some, some more new drama or some new breaking news or some new tea or somebody did some more stupid shit, I feel like. Excuse my language, but... Nothing's going to come into this person's life because they're not... They're blocking their healing. They haven't healed their inner childhood wounds. And they're not even supposed to be over here in this situation in the first place. They're supposed to have left that situation alone a long time ago, I feel like. And that's what this person was restricted. They feel limited or maybe they felt stuck to a situation. Whatever this three of wands in reverse energy is, it's definitely a delay. But I feel like this person is so frustrated. There's like a lot of conflict in this home. King of Swords in reverse. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. You know, this person here was dishonest. I'm telling you, someone loves control. Someone is very dishonest. Just love control. Somebody here loves to run away from their problems, but they cannot run away from those problems. Wheel of Fortune here in reverse. This person has tried to run away from these problems instead of addressing them head on, I feel like. I feel like this is a constant cycle this person has went through. They should have let it go a long time ago. Six of Swords in reverse and the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. The thing is, this person tries so hard to be in control. They, this King of Swords love to be in control, but the, in all actuality, they don't have control over anything. So, um, 
nothing in this person's life is going to really, I feel like, improve until they learn this lesson and do what it is that they need to do. I feel like this emperor, this masculine, wants the truth to be revealed or the truth was revealed to this masculine. Yeah, it was. Some shit, some shit came out. Look at the bottom of the deck. It's a six of wands and the emperor. Some shit came out. Some shit was made public. Ace of swords is underneath that with the seven of swords. Like something happened here. Some, yeah, something happened. Somebody, this is all because somebody resisted the change and they resisted doing and, and being obedient, knowing full well they weren't supposed to still be in this situation in the first place, but they decided to stay or go back or, you know, for whatever reason. And it's like somebody tried to delay this for as long as they could. And the, and the bottom line is they were not able to. And I really believe this person wants to really low-key be single anyways, but this person is still like, um, where are my, I wanted to pull these other cards. I don't know what I did, but I'm holding on y'all. Dang. I don't know where I put them. Please, these. I bought a new deck. Show me what else here. Yeah, see. Uh oh. Somebody has a dark side. This person is definitely here, not ready to settle down or be in any type of commitment or relationship, regardless of whether or not they're with the person that they're in this home with or they're single. Like, this person, I feel like, is just. They, that's a part of them. They got to heal regardless of who they're with. This person just has a hard time committing, period. There is something going on to... This person really neglected their inner child. I'm telling you. Maybe even someone here neglected a child or their own inner child. Hmm. Yeah. Somebody's not taking care of their emotional needs. They're out of touch. They're spiraling out of control down a really deep, dark rabbit hole. Like, there's so much drama going on. There's no peace in this person's life. And this person just wants to escape. Or they want to escape. Yeah, they want somebody want to jump out a window and run. Look at this hole, this rabbit hole. And then you see how this window is open and it says escape. And on the bottom of that is tangled and flighty. This person is having so much anxiety. They've gotten themselves into a situation they cannot get out of. You know, um, a lot of anxiety. You know, somebody literally wants to go, but I feel like somebody has so much secrets. There are so many secrets between these two people. And somebody's not being honest and telling the truth. They're just not. But I feel like one person here in this situation is having to face the truth. Finally having to face the truth. Somebody putting two and two together. And whenever this two and two was put together, it, yeah, I, it was a lot of drama apparently. I don't... Wow. Um... That was very interesting. I'm going to leave it alone, okay? Um, Sagittarius energy came out here. Um, Gemini Libra Aquarius came out. A lot of Leo. Gemini, fixed sign energy. I mean, everybody really is out here, but... And those signs I mentioned earlier. So hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, please. And I'll see y'all later. Have a good night. <laughs> Bye.